Hello everyone. I am Sonali Kanave, Assistant Professor of Computer Engineering Department of All India Sri Shivaji Memorial Society, Institute of Information Technology, Pune. Today uh, we are discussing about the introduction to C++ in that uh, some part we are discussed in previous video. In that video, we are discussing about the class, what is classes. <coughs> classes, then what is object, uh, then methods and attributes. Classes are, uh, if, uh, classes uh, are user defined data types that act as an uh, the Uh, that as the blueprint for individual object attribute and methods. Then objects are nothing but the instance of class created with specifically defined data object can correspond to real world object uh, or an abstract entity. When class is defined initially, the description uh, is the only object that is de uh, defined. Then the method, methods are uh, the function that are defined inside a class that describe the behavior of an object. So the attributes are defined in the class template and represent the state of an object. Object will have data stored in the attribute field and class attribute belong to the class itself. So uh, some uh, attributes are there or the principles are there in that encapsulation, abstraction, polymorphism and inheritance are there. Uh, then... Uh, <laughs> The structure of C++ in that there are three types, uh, sorry, uh, there are uh, three sections. First is the standard uh, standard library section, the main function section and function body section. So this is the uh, basic structure of C++. Uh, first is the documentation section in that uh, we have mostly include comments. That is, it may be a single line comment or multi line comment. Then link, uh, second one is the linking section in that uh, mostly we add uh, some header files like hash include uh, stdio.h or hash include ponyo.h uh, ponyo like that. Then definition section in that uh, we define some uh, uh, attribute uh, like uh, hash define then constant suppose pi is equal to uh, hash define uh, pi is equal to 3.14 like that. Then uh, uh, global declaration section in that we declare some global variable or global function uh, those very uh, global variable is nothing but the, those variables are declared uh, before uh, before uh, or outside the main function it is nothing but the global variable or those uh, functions are which are declared uh, before the main function uh, it is nothing but the global function then uh, next is the class definition in that we mostly use the class keyword. Then uh, next is the uh, main function. Uh, main function for uh, it, uh, the, the program will start uh, uh, using the main function. Uh, without main function, we can't execute the program. So more main function is most in, important for execution. Then next is the user defined function uh, definition. In that, uh, we uh, user defined function means uh, what exactly the logic we are building here. The then uh, this is a uh, so this is the uh, the very basic structure of C plus plus. Then there is the uh, next is a uh, add a uh, simple program of addition of two numbers. In that hash include io stream uh, dot h using namespace uh, standard uh, then semicolon. So uh, the hash include IO uh, stream. It is nothing but the documentation session. Uh, sorry, it is nothing but the header files. It is the linking section or definition section. Then int main, it is the main function. And in that uh, we give some variables, first number, second number, and sum. Uh, these are the integer type of variable. Then uh, C out. Uh, in that uh, we uh, give, uh, give the two numbers or two integers. Then uh, here uh, see first number and second number uh, we are uh, given to the user. Then sum of two numbers is storing variable sum of two numbers. Then uh, addition of these two number sum is equal to first number plus second number and print sum. So this is the uh, C out. 
statement to print this sum and last one is the uh, return zero because uh, we uh, main function is the integer type so here we uh, return some value integer value so return zero okay then next is the classes in c++ class uh, a class in c++ uh, is the building block that leads to object oriented programming it is a user defined data type which holds its own data member and member function which can be accessed and used by creating an uh, instance of that class so uh, c++ class is like a blueprint for an object uh, for example consider the car there are uh, uh, there may be uh, many cars with different name and brand but all uh, all of them will share some common properties like uh, all of them will have four wheels then speed limit mileage range etc so here car is the class and wheel speed limit mileage are their properties so how to uh, create the class a class is defined in c++ using keyword class followed by the name of that class uh, the body of the class is defined inside a curly brackets and terminated by a semicolon at the end so class class name then curly bracket uh, some data or some uh, functions uh, declare here and then semicolon uh, sorry curly bracket close and semicolon this is the example then next is the constructor a constructor in class is a special method that is automatically called when an object of a class is created. To create a constructor, uh, use same uh, name as the class followed by parentheses. Suppose, uh, for example, class my class. Then for, uh, this is the class name my class, and then public is the access modifier or access specifier. Then my class uh, is this, uh, is the uh, constructor because uh, constructor name is same as the class name then see out uh, when we are uh, when we are uh, display the output that is hello world and then main function is most important because main without main function or without main method we can't execute the program so my class then to create the object of that uh, my class that is uh, my obj and uh, then uh, then we access uh, using this object we access the uh, this function uh, functions attribute like the see out statement here we are pre printed then return zero is uh, necessary because uh, we uh, take the uh, main main uh, methods data type integer okay thank you